Hello friends, welcome to another episode of Brains Gossip. In this tutorial, we will be learning about the bond angle of CH4 molecule. Now, many of us do know that the bond angle of CH4 molecule is 109.5. But do you ever ask yourself that why the bond angle is 109.5? Now, CH4 is a tetrahedral molecule. And the structure of CH4 molecule is like this. Now here the bond angle is 109.5. Now uh, we can prove that the bond angle of CH4 is 109.5 by using standard geometrical method. That means that we take the forces between C and H is F1, this is H1 and this is H2, this is H3 and this is H4. So I am naming it C H1, H2, H3, H4. So I am just giving the name basically. So the carbon molecule is in the equilibrium for these forces F1, F2 f3 plus f4 equal to 0. Now from the symmetry you can say that the modulus of f1, f2, f3 equal to f4 on the modulus not the direction that means the difference of this f1, f2, f3, f4 is for their direction but their modulus is same. Now, the angle which we are going to calculate is theta, we are taking it theta. Now, whatever be the angle theta, this angle is same for all. And this is another assumption for the from the symmetry that if this angle is theta, this angle will also be theta and the angle between 1 and 3 will also be theta. So, these all the angles, this one, this one, and also this one, and again this one, and this one too, will also be theta. This is due to the symmetry, because this f1, f2, f3, f4 will be equal in amplitude. Now, I am multiplying f1 by another f1, and then f1 by f2 and then f1 dot f3 and then f1 dot f4 so i'm just multiplying this whole quantity with f1 now this will be f1 square this will be f1 dot this will be f1 f2 basically this will be f1 f2 cos theta plus f1 f3 cos theta plus f1 f4 cos theta equal to 0. Now I am replacing f2 by f1 so you can write f1 square plus f1 square cos theta again f1 square cos theta again f1 square cos theta equal to 0 so 1 plus 3 cos theta equal to 0 i'm just canceling, canceling out this f1 and adding this uh, cos theta terms so cos theta equal to minus 1 by 3 so theta equal to cos inverse of 1 by 3 now the value of this cos inverse minus 1 by 3 is the answer so thanks a lot for watching if there is any doubt so you can leave a comment below and uh, please let me know whether you are satisfied with the proof or not so thanks a lot for watching